Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my March Ipsy bag. If you don't know what Ipsy is, it's a $10 subscription service, $10 flat. You don't pay shipping, none of that. You take a quiz, they curate, curate, I think, yeah, beauty products to your liking that fit your skin tone, eye color, all of that. And I get it every month so I can show you guys. So I'm just going to show you Marches. I did February's, I did January's, December, November's, if you want to go see those will be linked or suggested in the corner and yeah this is the bag that they come in and it's, it's cool getting this nice pink bag every month and this oh it's actually really cute this month this is the they give you a makeup bag that all the products come in which is nice because you can reuse this as a makeup bag tampon bag all of that whatever you want to put in here you can it's up to you it's your bag and then the card this month says, Hello Spring. We're having a spring fling with Flawless. Celebrate the season with a spotlight on radiant, selfie ready skin, flushed cheeks, and a fresh kick of color on eyes or lips. So without further ado, I'm just going to start pulling products out of this. I want to try to keep my Ipsy videos hopefully under 8 minutes. That's really my goal. I feel like that's a, that's a good goal to start out with. Under 5 would be better, but we're going to see what we can do. So the first product I have which I'm really excited about because I have not tried these yet, is the NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick in Pink Lust slash Passion Rose, and it's the color 08. As you can see, it's a full-sized product. I cannot wait to try this. Such a pretty color, and um, I've never tried these before, so this is definitely one of the better products I've gotten in my Ipsy bag for sure. So the second item I'm pulling out is a Mana Kadar Beauty product and it looks like it is a eyeshadow and it's new so it's right up my alley very pretty color yeah it's definitely an eyeshadow and the color is fantasy just in case you were wondering so the third product I'm pulling out is a brush and it's not from Crown Brush, which makes me very excited because I hate Crown Brush brushes. I got them in two separate bags, rated them badly, which is a cool thing you can do on Ipsy. If you don't like the product, you can always rate it bad and then they won't give it to you anymore. So thankfully I don't get Crown Brush brushes anymore, but this is a Bogachis brush. Um, I'll leave the spelling on the screen and it's a really nice uh, eyeshadow brush. The brush seems like it's good quality. I'm pulling at it, no hairs are coming out, and it seems sturdy, so this is nice. I've actually wanted a brush for a while. I was just scared they were gonna give me a crown brush, so kind of not been hoping for it. So that's the third product. The fourth product is a bronzer by Temp2 in the shade Warm Glow. And I really don't bronze. And what kind of sucks is there's already already some product out of it. I mean, there's a lid, but I mean, there's already some product out of it. But it seems like a really pretty color. Like I said, the color is warm glow and it's a bronzer. I really don't use bronzer, but maybe that'll help. And then the last product is pretty big. It's a Marc Anthony True Professional Nourishing Argan Oil of Morocco 3-Day Smooth perfect blow dry smoothing cream it says it holds hair straight frizz free and shining for up to three days and it's for all hair types and infused with keratin i have curly hair and um if i'm remembering correctly keratin makes your hair straight which is which is not what i want i have a poof here for a reason so i don't want straight hair so i probably won't be using this it says ultralight argan oil and shea butter smooths, eliminates frizz, and holds curls and waves straight for up to three days. Keratin and vitamin E protect against heat styling. Hairs love glossy, ultra smooth, and full of body. So if I do decide to straighten my hair or whatever, I've only done it once in the last year, I definitely will be using this product because basically it's a heat protectant. It's a fancy heat protectant. And it says you can find these pro this product at Rite Aid and Ulta. And it's a pretty good sample size. It's 1.69 fluid ounces. And that's assuming this is the sample size. It could very easily, easily be the full size. And it smells amazing. It's Argan Oil of Morocco. So, yeah, 
Yeah, it smells amazing. It smells amazing. I'm here for it. Okay, so if we want to review the bag or whatever, I got a Nourishing Argan Oil over Morocco 3 Day Smooth by Marc Anthony. I got a Manicadar Beauty Eyeshadow in the color Fantasy. I got a Bronzer Sample by Temp2 in the color Warm Glow. I got a eyeshadow brush by Beau Gachis Paris, maybe. And then I also got that full suede uh, NYX lip cream in the color, what was it, Pink Lust? I can't find it on, I have no idea where it went. But this bag is definitely better than last month's. I don't even think I used any of last month's products yet. I did use the blush, the blush is nice, but other than that I really didn't use anything from that. So. Yeah, this was really quick and I'm not used to that, especially for these unbaggings. But, um, throughout the video there should be polls in the corner, maybe a suggested video. If you do the poll, I really appreciate it. It usually gives me an idea of what video to do next. I like to do the Ipsy, uh, unbagging videos. They really don't get a lot of views, but I like them, so I feel like it's still important for me to do them. And I feel bad if I don't do them, so... Yeah, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, subscribe to me if you want to see more videos. I'm trying to get better with editing, lighting talking on camera all of that i mean it's really something to get used to and you don't know that until you actually start doing it but yeah if you like the video like it um subscribe if you want comment do you get ipsy what was your favorite product this month i feel like it came a whole lot quicker than it did but yeah that's all i have to say so hope you have a good day